Hey guys, it's Eleni, and I'm going to show you how to make a little small bow. What you'll need is an even piece of ribbon. If you don't have ribbon, just use fabric, but it's easier with ribbon. Okay, there you go. What you'll need is a bobby pin or an alligator clip. I have both. Uh, red and ribbon, of course. So what you'll need to do is you'll need to take this and cross it over and pull. But you need it to be very kind of um, even. Perfect, it's even. Now, you'll do it again because you need to do it three times in order for you to see if you're using the thick ribbon, you only need to do it maybe once or twice. But I'm doing it three times because my ribbon is thin and small. So I'm going to do it triple times. So just do that. Make sure it's even. And tie. See? Now you can see the big knot. It's like the... Now you can see it. Okay. Just make sure it's secure. Then take your part and, of course, make it however the big loop you want. I'm, I'm doing this because I'm only going to, because I have a very small ribbon. Then you're going to cut the excess off, but leave a small piece left. Like. You can cut it diagonal. It makes it a little more cute. I cut it diagonal. I don't know if you can see that. And then you're going to wrap it first. You're going to, to do your other loop, you're going to wrap it over the other part where you cut the ribbon because you want it to be secure so the ribbon doesn't fall. So hold it and then make sure you hold it the whole time because you'll do it and then it'll be really hard. So There we go, now it's even. You can do off if you want, but I'm doing even. Then just cut the excess ribbon off. Okay. So now you can undo that. So you'll have enough you want. Do not throw away these other pieces, I'm sorry. If you did, cut some small pieces, because you'll probably need those later. Um, then you just do it the same way, but how the length you wanted it. See, it's the same way. Then wrap it around again. If you did it uneven, that's totally fine. Just cut the excess off. There we go. And you got the perfect little keep up. Then you're going to take, I prefer a bobby pin. But if you don't, that's fine. It's not going to kill it. But I prefer a body pin because um, I want it to be small enough so I can fit it on there. Body pins don't work as well, but they do hold it together. So you're going to get your thread ready. I already had mine ready, but fine. You're going to get your thread. And then you want to scoop, like, you want to take it take your bow out very slowly because you don't want to mess it up and then you're going to make a little you want to grab the ends of your thread and put them together so you can make a little hoop um i don't know if you can see let's put it in black so you can see it a little better i don't know if you, yeah there and then you're going to want to wrap this around the thing and then pull back And then you want to twist it at the bottom so it'll be secure. Then you want to wrap the rest of it around. You want it to be the same color of your um, ribbon so it doesn't look kind of weird, you know. It gives it a, you know, a little cuteness to it. But um, it doesn't have to be the same color, but it, it'll just look a little more formal and cute. Then wrap it all around keep it here. Do not let go because, you know, 
Unless you tied it already. And tie it. But, um, so keep it like this. You wrapped it so many times that it won't come off. See? So it's cute. Um, you can actually take, um, there, there are existing tiny bobby pins, tiny ones, but I don't use them and I don't buy them. But, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. So I'm taking a regular bobby pin, just a regular one, the, my hair color, and I'm taking a rubber band. Um, if you, this is not, you need to do this. If you just want to keep this and tape it or glue it onto something, that's fine. But I'm just showing you some tips you can use for your bow. So take your little hair band and don't put the bow on it, put the bobby pin on it. So it'll look like, you know, that. Then you're going to take the bow and you're going to push it through, of course, just put it on. And then, you don't really need a hairband on it if you're going to put it in your hair. And then you want to kind of clip it onto there. It'll be fine. But, you know, I don't know if this, I can't really see what I'm doing. Maybe you can see it. I don't know. But I'm just going to take that out because I don't want to mess up my face. Okay, so it's not exactly secure because you just wrap string on it. But, um, it's fine. You want to, there'll be two sides on it, and there'll be, like, little excess parts, like, by how I'm holding this, and there's another short piece on the other side. But you want to find your two things and pull them so they'll be secure. But you don't want to unravel it or unwrap it. I don't know if I used the right word for that, but... <laughs> And then when it's tight and secure, you can just cut that part off. You know, it's not bad, but it's pretty cool. Um, anyways, um, as you can see, if you look closely, it'll be kind of sticking out, and you won't want that. You can leave it. It's not a big deal. But for me, you know, I would like something more formal and cute if I'm going to a wedding or something. But um, what you'll do is you'll take your small pieces... I have a very small one, but I'm not going to use that one. I'm going to use this middle size one, and I'm going to wrap it around. Well, not wrap it, but more of a put it like that so it'll be together, and you can just clip it together. And then um, you can hot glue gun it. I don't. I have a hot glue gun, but I'm not going to take it out. But you can hot glue gun it, and it'll look like a little like this. But you want to get it even, so yeah. See, and then you can just. Use a bobby pin and clip it on there, or, you know, put it on a headband, um, put it on an alligator clippy and just clip it on there if you have black hair or something. Um, put it in your binder, glue it on your binder, you know, it's pretty cool. Anyways, um, thanks for watching, subscribe, add to your favorites, comment, and, you know, suggest some things that I can do. Uh, anyways, it's really cute, oh la la. Anyways, thanks for watching, bye.